Thank you for tuning in to another episode of WGC Fits. Today, we are going to be taking a look at the KBS shaft profile for players potentially swinging something in an extra stiff. So we have Captain Ball Speed testing stuff out for us. How are you doing today, Captain Ball Speed? Doing great. Feel good? Oh, I feel great. Look good? Thank you. Play, you good. play good? There we go. See, bingo. So what is your basic understanding of KBS shafts in general? None, because I've never really hit them before. So we're gonna have to. I've heard that. my first. <laughs> I've hit my first KBS tour shaft this year, and I don't even know what it was. I think it was the tour. Okay. So we know that you've kind of been out there saying you like my irons yes. for a minute, right? Those are money tapers, yeah. right? So we know that you're kind of interested in something like this. So we want to sit there and try to get one some profiles out there, do a little comparison between it all, but also I'd like some feedback from you in terms of what you're feeling. Okay. Okay. So we're starting off with what? The tour. KBS tour. X. Extra stiff. Yes. Now we're testing all of these in the uh, Cobra uh, tour head, yeah, right? Yeah, King tour. King tour head. Um, standard length, standard lie. So very controlled window, right? Go ahead and hit a couple shots here for us, Ian. We'll let you hit some and then we'll talk about the profile. Already just feeling it like this. Doesn't mm -hmm. feel like 130 grit. No, no, this one will not. This one, so the big thing about KBS is has always been feel, right? Feel and then try to produce trajectories that are very much controlled, let's say. Yeah, okay? which is what I need help with. Exactly, that's what everybody needs help with. Yeah. Um, go ahead and hit a couple and we'll talk about this guy. Okay. It is a little bendy. Little bendy, okay. Just like here. Okay. But it doesn't feel heavy. No, not heavy. Is, right? it, a, is, it, is it counterbalanced, Jeff? It's got a kind little of? counterbalance in there. Yep. Ah. So this is a little counterbalanced. It is going to produce, it, it's listed, I would say, as like a low spin, low launch kind of profile. But again, with that counterbalance window, it's, it's going to not feel incredibly harsh or incredibly heavy. Which right? I, I'm kind of digging, mm -hmm. but I don't like pull draws. Oh, <laughs> just drew a little bit. Just a little bit. It, it smooths. Mm -hmm. Is it meant for more of a smooth swing? Just not, not necessarily, in, a, in comparison to what we're gonna hit for the rest of these, this is for a guy who's fast, yeah. but not necessarily a guy who's like super crazy heavy loader, you know? Okay, which I am not a heavy load guy. No. Yeah, that's more me. Okay. Yeah, that one was uh, that one was good. Mm -hmm. mm. Not too bad at all. You like the numbers? Not bad. Well, let's see what happens when I miss it. Won't be too too bad. Yeah, I think I just missed those first two. Mm -hmm. It feels a little too flingy, like. Uh, and again, we've discussed this where we like the idea of counterbalance for you in the woods. Yeah. We don't necessarily love it if it's overly counterbalanced in irons for Correct. you. Correct. But honestly, that that one was really nice. Mm -hmm. See if I just had those all day, I'd be I I wouldn't be here. <laughs> <laughs> you just had those all day, you just wouldn't be working, you know. <laughs> all right, so let's go from there into opposite end of the spectrum. No, I think we go Tor V next. Okay, because Tor V I think is probably a little bit closer to this than the next two. Tor V. So so what does this say? Well. Give me some uh, some thoughts and some feels about this guy first. Actually, feels a little heavier. Where at? Oh, uh, the tip. Mm -hmm. Well, oh yeah, by the tip. Mm -hmm. 
Now, knowing what you know and what you've learned this year doing all this stuff, what's that tell you? Eli, Ian Likey. Hmm? Ian Likey. Ian Likey. <laughs> so what it is, is it's a little bit of a softer profile compared to what you just said. Um, still going to be kind of like that low mid launch, low mid spin window, but overall a little bit lighter, a little bit softer than the tour. I, say, I would say you just hit. But it feels heavier. Again, because of where the weight swing is. Weight. Yeah. Yeah. Swing weight's a little bit different than actual weight. Okay. So how much are these items? <laughs> You're gonna have to look that one up. Oh dear. Who smoked? Oh dear. That's a good spin rate. That's a great golf shot. All right, let's see if we can do it two times. I don't care about two times in a row. I want to see three times in a row. All right, three times. So it feels a little. Yeah, I I just hit it on the bottom or the That's right. the groove up. A miss at 190 yards of carry at 6,900 spin. I'm not mad at. It definitely feels heavier through transition, mm -hmm. but a little more boardy. Interesting. Like straight, uh, just here. Mm -hmm. Like the KBS, I felt was like a nice smooth curve, kind of mm -hmm. like a. This one you're feeling. This one I feel like it curves here and then it just stops and straight at the bottom. Okay. Okay. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Does that make any sense? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it feels perspective, right? I mean, that's that's all you. I can feel this part move. You are you are here to give us feedback on feel. So, yes, that is correct. Because mm -hmm. it's whatever you feel. I like that feeling. That was a good golf shot as well. A little spinny, but again, you cut it a little open. Well, that one was me. Huh. So far, the first two like to go a little left. Mm -hmm. And again, right, both of these profiles are, even though, like this one specifically, right, so some I said for a long time, you kind of like the way it feels and stuff, right? But weight-wise, I, I do think we have to go something that's got a little bit more in it for you. Yeah. Well, when it works, it works. Very stable golf shaft, I'd have to say. Mm -hmm. Well, that's one of the things that KBS does quite well, right? Yeah. Stability. Stability. Now we are going to look at the C taper. The tour's not bad, right? I mean... I like to feel the golf shaft, right? Yeah, right? Like, that's, I think, something that is different for me and you. You want to feel the whole thing, yeah. right? For me, I just want to feel kind of like a hammer, right? Wait in the end. Yeah. Just different, different things for different people. Everybody's different, right? Yeah. The biggest part when doing fittings is general, in general is to attempt to identify that weight profile that they do like and kind of go from there. Correct. So now we have the C taper. Once again, a different profile. This one, you are definitely going to feel weight on the bottom. Oh, uh, I, I, yeah. This one is definitely a low launching, low spinning shaft. Carrying this club out here, I thought this shaft was heavier than those three combined. <laughs> well, I'm not sure. <laughs> like doing that this. Is not the case, but <laughs> it has some serious weight to it. I know. It's 130 grams. Jesus. Very, just everything stiff kind of profile. Is there any give to this thing? There is. It's just where that give is, you know? Which is where? Oh, I'll find out. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Where'd that go? Dead straight. Uh, yeah, that's what I thought it did. <laughs> See, there's, there's a reason why this whole thing became a thing right and why is that this is one of those shafts where you can really kind of lean on it right and you don't have to worry about getting out of whack so i have to really swing at this thing yeah this isn't for the guy who's trying to feather oops i'm sorry 
Where's the give yet? I don't, is it just the grip, like here? Just, just the rubber on the grip? Yeah. <laughs> so it, again, the, the weight profile on this one, it is just overall- Like up here. Fairly stiff, right? Yeah. I mean, there's there's not, this, this is, this is, again, this is for the guy who's trying to lean on it, right? I think that Sergio and Phil might yeah. have been two of the first guys out there really playing this guy. I mean, I feel like I have to really go at this thing. Mm -hmm. That was a bad thing. The minute you try to lay off of it, right, what's going to happen is... I don't know what's going to happen. Well, it, you're, you're probably going to hit it left. Yeah. You know? I think that was the second one, honestly. Mm -hmm. Well, those the one and three are great. They're right on top of each other. One of the very real things that come with a profile like this is the thought process of I can go at it, I'm not gonna have to worry about it, and I can just kind of swing the way I want to swing. Yeah. But that's why the profile doesn't fit everyone, you know? I, I don't know if that's for me. <laughs> I can feel it stiff. Mm -hmm. Well, it, it's a, I don't think that you, this would not be one that I would try for you. Oh, because then we get a miss like that. Well, that's not terrible. Again, the misses aren't ever going to get crazy on you, you know? I just don't like those two guys. But anyways. From a feel, it's not there. But again, look at how tight your front to back is. Oh, that's that's great. That's one of the things that you get from a benefit of that shaft. Yeah. Right? Okay, last but not least, we are going to look at one of my favorites. One of Captain Center Strike's favorites. And maybe not one of my favorites. The money taper. This kind of takes everything that's good about the C taper, everything good about KBS Tour, brings it all together, and makes one big happy family of golf. Of golf shaft. Yes. Big fan of this one. I love the way it feels. Let's let Ian kind of hit a couple. Let's see what we think. Now, from your irons, I love this chip. Yes. yes. And I am right there with you. Love everything about it. I love where the weight's at. I love the feel. It'd look better in black, though. I almost got those. Now, don't quote me. That might be your fastest ball speed today. Well... I like to close it today. It feels smooth. Mm -hmm. hey, maybe we are aimed at the pole. <laughs> <laughs> well, right on top of each other. Yep. Same exact spin. Slightly counterbalanced, but not crazy counterbalanced. I like that, though. You have... A oh feeling in the shaft in terms of some feel, right? Oh, yeah. It's not just a super board. It is stiff. It is very stable, right? Definitely falls into... That's the shot. That, like, lower launching, lower spinning profile again. Um, I just hit it high. <laughs> you know, thing to note, because I can kind of tell, I can see your wear pattern on your face thus far. Your strike is slightly higher on the face with this, right? Th that tip that's just a touch more active is letting you actually create that better strike point. That's why your shots are a little bit more predictable here. Yeah. You know, everything about this is, like I said, the best of the, you know, the KBS tour world and the KBS C taper world, in my opinion. And I know Trent's opinion is similar to that as well. Oh, that's the Ian golf shot. So here's what we can say. Looking at your results, you're definitely a money taper guy. Okay. Numbers don't lie. That is incredible across the board. Can I get a show all, please? You can. Just for the viewers at home. Yeah, white like the white it what was the white? The tour? Tour. It felt like it it, it would Stay bent a little too long, and I hit it on the top. This is a little bit more, a little bit more stiff than that uh, tip yeah. section, right? I mean, we feel that profile-wise. Yeah. This one's definitely got a little bit more in there at the bottom, like the C taper, 
right? Yeah. Not as crazy as the C taper, but it's still got some of that profile in there. Correct. And then the top end, under the grip and stuff, it's a little bit more like the Tour, yeah. right? Kind of best of both worlds, like I said. So profile wise, really good middle of the road between those two, you know? Um, and the seat taper wasn't bad, but I just like, I can't give it all all the time. I all the time. Yeah. You want to be able to play touch shots, right? Yeah. I'm the exact same way, right? Everyone who's ever done fittings with me say, you have to try the seat taper, right? I mean, you know, I don't like swinging like that all the time, yeah. you know? Um, not only that, but my elbow doesn't like when I swing no, like yeah, that Neither does mine. So, you know, the money taper to me was a very, you know, happy medium. And I, I this has eliminated the idea that was stuck in my head for a long time, which was you had to go find something that's like a graphite because your elbow sucks, you know? Don't have to do that anymore. Yeah. You know, it just, it's letting me play golf, which is good. <laughs> well, well, initial thoughts of KBS is pretty cool. They they do a lot of good stuff, right? When, it, when they talk about really, I think, differentiating profiles, I think they do quite a good job. When you talk about... I mean, all four of these were different feelings so. and you can feel that yeah. quite quickly right um but then the other thing that i quite like about them is in terms of and again this isn't just now this really is modern shafts in general but it was almost something that you know was a trend that might have been started by this company which is when it comes to things like quality control top notch these guys you know just really really good at producing the same things over and over again right yeah you're not going to get one thing that feels a little bit different you know very often now it happens with everybody but these guys spend a little bit of time doing that so yeah um kbs in general very good company man very good i shaft. like this shaft window so you're going to get some of these in your next set right how long has has mr ping said said this never never <laughs> He's just lying. He's only been saying this for like six months, so. Only. <laughs> only. Um, no, all things, you know, joking aside, like I said, they just make good stuff. And if it's a company that you probably haven't heard of or haven't tried before, definitely recommend coming and trying them out. They're definitely very recommend. Trying. They they have a little bit of something for everybody, right? Your, your bigger swingers, your slower swingers, whatever works, right? Um, I think they have nine like different steel offerings. Mm -hmm. when I checked him up before this. Yeah. And like I said, this is just the window where if you're swinging an iron at, you know, a hundred dollars an hour, <laughs> which is again, a small window, but you know, again, if you like a little the bit tour of weight, if you like the tour weight of yeah. an iron, mm -hmm. this is what um, you can do. And this is a little bit of a different window for us for videos that we're trying out. So let us know in the comments, if you like the idea of these kind of shaft overviews and companies and stuff like that. So, um, Thank you for tuning in to another episode, right? Please like and subscribe and uh, come check us out if you have any questions about anything KBS. We'll see you.